friends, Heidi here from Rain Country. God is good all the time. And I just wanted to do a quick video showing you the easiest way to grow green onions. And that is by simply going to the grocery store, buying yourself some bunches of green onions in the produce department. Get organic if you can find them, but if you can't, non-organic isn't so bad when you're talking onions and garlic, things like that. And then use the green part of the onion how you normally would in your stir fries, in your kimchi, whatever it is. Just chop it up and then cut it clear down, getting that white part pretty short. You can get it, you can leave as much there or as little as you want. And then right here, I've got those two little ends. Now in various pots around here, I've got some green onions that I started this year that are in various stages of growth because I've uh, bought several bunches at different times because I've really just had a hankering for kimchi lately, so I've been getting back into that. And so, and I'll put a little video clip here showing some of the various pots, the different sizes. I only had one of the ones from last year that came back. Now here's the great thing about green onions is that once you've got them in the ground and they're growing, they will grow like this all season. I can usually keep collecting onions off of them, clear up to a, sometime in December. And then usually January, February, they die back. Sometimes they'll start to regrow again and sometimes they don't. So all you need to do, let me take this basket off here, is I take the, the roots that are off of there and just kind of break them a little bit. I don't cut them all off. I just sort of break a few off. What this will do is it will, it will help stimulate growth. Now it'll still grow even if you don't do that, but it's just a good idea. Then I just take my finger, make a hole in the soil, and then stick it down in there. And then I push the dirt. You don't even have to cover it. Just push the dirt around it so it's sitting in there good. Okay, and then let's do this other one right here. Stick that in there, push the dirt around it, and there we go. And like I said, no need to cover it all the way. And in a couple of days, you should start seeing some growth on those. Now, if you look in this pot right here, this one here I started several days ago and look at the green coming out of it. Uh, these some of these other ones these bigger ones are from like um maybe a week to two weeks ago and you can see uh some of these here some of these bigger ones are ready to cut back so what i do is i just allow them to grow when i need some i come out i cut them all the way down and then let it grow back and it'll just keep doing that and keep giving you more green onion throughout the rest of the year and like i said my, depending on your climate it might even grow for you clear up through winter so it's a very easy way. I find um, I have a difficult time starting onions from seed. I've tried it several times. I haven't done it in a long time, to be honest, but I do have some onion seed. I should, I meant to do it this year and then I totally spaced it. But anyway, this is one thing you can do, at least with the green onions, that just makes it easy. So you buy them, you use them, and then you just keep reusing them and using them and using them. So. Uh, it's just it's just a great and simple method to grow your own green onions. Okay, well, I hope you enjoyed this video and it gave you an idea to try something there. And even with the weird weather we've been having, the green onions have been one of the things that have done well for us. Okay, well, thanks for watching. Take care and God bless.